Greetings, Heritage Hawks. This is Mrs. Diaz de Leon. Boys and girls, today I would like to read one of my favorite all-time Dr. Seuss's books. There is a Wocket in my pocket. Did you ever have the feeling there is a wasket in your basket? Or a neuro in your bureau? Or a wasset in your closet? Sometimes I feel quite certain there is a jerton in the curtain. Sometimes I have the feeling there's a slock behind the clock. See the slock back there? And that zelf up on that shelf I have talked to him myself. There is Zelf. That's the kind of house I live in. There's a nink in the sink and a zamp in the lamp. And they're rather nice, I think. Some of them are very friendly, like the yacht in the pot and that yodel in the bottle. Some are not friendly, some are not. I like the zable on the table and the gare under the chair, but the bofa on the sofa? Well, I wish he wasn't there. Notice how they are reading as well, enjoying a great book. And those nutboards in the cupboards, they are good fun to have about. But that nooth brush on my toothbrush, him, I can do without. The one, the only one I'm really scared of is that bug under the rug. Do you see the bug there, boys and girls? <gasps> Frightens me. And that Quinny up the chimney, I don't like him, not at all. And it makes me sort of nervous when the Zal scoots down the hall. But the yeps on the steps, they're great fun to have around. And so are many, many other friends that I have found. Like the teller and the neller and the geller and the deller and the beller and the weller and the zeller in the cellar. So many of them. And the geeling on the zealing and the zower in my shower. <gasps> and the zillow on my pillow. I don't care if you believe it. That's the kind of house I live in, and I hope we never leave it. Boys and girls, I hope you have enjoyed. There's a Wocket in my pocket, and make certain that you read this week. Thank you, boys and girls. Bye, Hawks.